And um, of course, I got to give a big shout out because uh, we are at the hour mark. But I just wanted to bring up uh, the night shift, bro. We all listen to that. Larry Good job, Drew. Larry. Oh, yeah. We yeah. love music. Yeah. What do you say at the it's end of the fire, first song? Bro. He was like, if you see somebody with that organic shirt on. Yeah. <laughs> just say good Gotta job. Say good job. Yeah, bro. man. What's Yo, y'all, good uh, job, Larry. That was mad good. What's your favorite track off of there so far? Pop out right quick with uh, Schoolboy. It's, it's tough because for me, because it just feels like. I'll say why for it me. It just came out, man. It, I really. I, the I, only reason I'll say why for me, it was good to hear from Schoolboy. Nah, yeah, yeah. Schoolboy shit was on it. That's why I like that so much. That yeah. track for me. But was me and Zay was listening to it earlier. We should have. We said they should have had Grop Dad Four Thousand or whatever his name is. Grop mm-hmm. Daddy on there. He would have smoked that with them, yes. yo. And that would have been ultra bay smooth. Um, I say mine's right now is Glass House Knocking. Okay. That joint, it's tough. fire, bro. I'm not mad at that. Ultra sturdy. Did yo. y'all like Alks voice? Uh, Alks verse? Yes. On that joint? I love yeah. the Alchemist. Yeah. I already yeah. said the he Alchemist little, to me is a, little, a better rapper than the Eminem. He was a already. In oh with shit! The, the, I, did, I already said bad. that. I, I said it on right. Twitter. The Alchemist is a much better rapper than Eminem, yo. He's dropped uh, mixtapes, only a couple of them. But he got a song shaking off with Bronson Conway. <laughs> he was like, he be shaking off, bro. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to be going so yeah, hard on the weed in there on yeah, you, yeah, boy. Yeah. What? The what Alchemist is say? a better rapper than Eminem <laughs> already, bro. And his produ- his production, he's one of my top five producers of all time. Oh, that makes me happy. No, nah, but yeah, I agree. I, I, I don't even care. I agree. The one thing I will say is, all right, so I, I don't know about favorite. All right, so I'll say these two things. Salute to, uh, was that uh, Dage Loaf on there? Yep. Mm-hmm. I love I love her part on on the on the song. Yeah, that song, the song was mad. I gotta get to that song. I, I know what you're talking yeah. about. Yeah, yeah. And then, sweet um, lady, sweet lady. The song that's most conflicting because I want to say it's my it's kind of my favorite, right? So, and it makes me mad because all right. So Larry, for some reason, Ocean Cuisine, that beat is so hard, and he really wasn't spitting on there. No, oh, with the two he was just <laughs> yeah. He was just that floating. song is still hard he, though. No, no, no. But he was just. Floating on the track, and I'm like, bro, this fly. beat is too hard. Yeah, he just kept for you fly. not to be like he took off, on, like he just wanted to chill on that track. Then two chains came on. I like two chains part. Yeah, two chains smoked that. But if uh, Mike, if he wasn't gonna go crazy, two chains is perfect. And I feel like I feel like Spitter should Spitter should have been on that track. Oh uh, yeah, that would have been hard. Yeah, he had no spit on him. I was surprised. Spitter should have been on that track specifically. Yeah. Like you know, on, on Cardo stuff, he could rap on any of those beats and it sound good. Yeah, but like that song, oh like. Ocean Cuisine, that beat is that to me. That's my favorite yeah. like beat on it, and that whole thing is chock full of beats. But that's the only issue I have. I'm like, dang, Larry was just kind of like chilling on the track. I was like, come on, Larry, give us a couple hard bars at the very least, yo. And to let y'all know, I'm not capping on my Alchemist stance, yo. He got a <laughs> uh, album that came out like two weeks ago. It's called Flying High Part Two. It's um, what is it? Five <laughs> tracks, and then he has the five instrumentals. Um, but he got a song on there with uh, Conway the Machine called mm. Phil Drummond. He smoked it. He rapped on that level with those guys. Like okay. you could tell, he knows how to make beats and do all that. It's another joint yeah, one that came out. Um, called Royal Hand, bro. I'm talking about he a menace on the track. He really yeah. can rap, bro. I mean, he, I know he can that's because he be chilling with Earl Sweatshirt and them all the time. Like he probably just getting to rapping with him. Up. Like, bro, that stuff before them boys. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. He's yeah, yeah, been, yeah, yeah, he been yeah, rapping yeah, his whole rapping. life. He's been, been rapping. It, but no, that's he's how you really got nice, making bro. beats. He, he started he rapping for us. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they got it from him. Have y'all heard this song? Have y'all heard this song on um Hit Boys uh project where um basically Hit Boy produced half of the song and the Alchemist rapped over that. And then the Alchemist produced the last half of the song, yeah, and then Hit Boy rapped over that. No, I haven't heard. It's it. fire. They can yo. He Hit, really be shaking Hit off, Boy, yo. Hit Boy, he gets slippery the longer he rap, but he give you like a nice. Yo, he eight. can shake off. He yo. give yeah, you a he nice can shake eight, off a little bit. Like I know the people that that's in the in the in the in the stew shaking he be and baking. You a nice eight. I be like yo, Hit Boy. Yeah. I don't know if he ever stayed like if he just locked into the rap because he really be focused on the beats. Because yeah. he does basically all of the production either by himself or mostly by and himself. And he be producing R and B albums, all crazy. type of stuff. Like for the most part, mm-hmm. the Alchemist stays in his lane. Like rapper rappers, I'm making beats for y'all. Like that he stays in that. Yeah. But Hit Boy will produce something for Beyonce and then do a Dom uh, album yeah. and then go uh, nah, mess with Nas it. and then go do his own album. Yeah, and do his, his own. Yeah, it's do like his dad's bro. album. Yeah. Like this, he just doing everything. Yeah, I respect, I respect it, bro. Yeah. I respect it. 